What's going on guys, Matt McCoy, Country Song Teacher. Hope you're doing well. I'm coming live from the Music Barn. We're making a little music room here in my house. Man, we uh, call it the Music Barn. It's got the little barn scene behind there. I got, I got a new drum set over here, my piano over there, some guitars. So, making a cool music studio. So this is the first video from that little, from the music, from the McCoy Boy Music Barn. I'm teaching all three of my boys um, how to play guitar, piano, drums, that kind of thing. I'm actually learning drums myself, so stay tuned um, for some, um, beginner drum lessons once I learn a few things to teach, right? We'll go over finger picking country songs. How to finger pick some easy country songs. What I say all the time about finger picking is it helps you get chord clarity because you have to press the strings right. And it helps you just like listen for the timing. You have to be smooth with your timings, so you know, with the chord chains or that kind of thing. Let's play a fishing in the dark. Start with a regular D chord. Third, bottom string. Third string, bottom string, and then the second string, the second fret. Lazy and the moon coming up to the night, shining through the trees. See how that? I'm just going four, three, two, one, four. I'm using my thumb. I want you to not use a pick to just, I want you to practice really using your thumb. Again, make sure you have that chord clarity. Lazy and the moon coming up tonight, shining through the breeze. Trees. Now again, keep that ring finger there, then lock the two bottom strings and go fifth and sixth for your G. You're from six, five, four, three. Crickets are singing a lightning bug, floating on the breeze. Baby, get. Again, keep that pivot on that ring finger. Back to D. Ready. Every now I take my middle finger on and off that bottom string. Cross the field where the creek turns back by the whole stump of road. Again, lock the two bottom strings, go up G. Six, five, four, three. I'm gonna take it to a special place nobody knows. Baby, get ready. Now you gotta keep the ring finger on the second string, press the two middle strings. It's from five, four, three, two for the A chord. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Make the D. You and me gonna go fishing in the dark. Nine on our back. Counting the stars with a G. Cool grass grows. Down by the river in the full moonlight. We'll be falling in love. Middle of the night just G. Now you're going to be an E minor, kind of an E minor 7. Keep your ring finger on the 2nd string, press the 5th and 4th together. Stay the whole night through. So I'm going, see from the 5th and 4th, on the E minor down to A. Stay the whole night through. Feel so good to be with you. By the way, I'm working on a Matt's favorite song book where I've got... 20 of the favorite songs that when I grab a guitar, I always play. This one's in there, so you're gonna check that out. It's either coming out next week or the following week, so stay tuned for that one. Um, I'm excited about that. Let's, let's take some other, strong, other songs here. Um, let's do what Luke Combs always play that when she gets the best of me. So remember, you're going C. She got the best of me. She stole my heart, now all slept me. So you're doing a four count. With each chord, you're doing it twice before you change. So a C A nine, go five four three two five four three two. Go to the G six five four three six five four three. E minor five four three two five four three two D four three two one four three two one. You do that over and over. She got the best of me. She broke my heart. Now all slipped me. Is beating in this guitar. Follows me around, so you give what's left to me. So you give what's deep left to me. She got the best of me. So remember, on that CN9, you're going 5, 4, 3, 2, 5, 4, 3, 2 on the G, 6, 5, 4, 3, 6, 5, 4, 3 on the E minor, 5, 4, 3, 2, 5, 4, 3, 2 on the D. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one. So again, this, these are just easy finger picking songs that you want to really listen for the timing, listen for chord clarity. 
I said it's going to help you out a lot. Um, let's, 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 let's think of another one here. Um, nothing I do all the time. I will sing my wish. So I do this one a D chord with kind of a D sus without a uh, regular D chord without the bottom bottom string pressed. You can start the D chord. I will sing my wish to the G river on the dry. Like a G bird upon the wind. Waters on my sky, I'm never... So notice too, I'm using the same chords as Fish in the Dark. D, G, and an E minor, A. Reach my destination. G, if I never try, so I will. D, sail my vessel. A, to the river on the dry. So let's say you're a beginner, you're like, man, I'm not ready to do any kind of finger picking. I'm not that advanced. I'm not that advanced yet. Maybe learn these songs. Like I said, all these songs are in my song books, that kind of thing. Just do it. You're, you're listening for that timing. I've been teaching my boys this as far as music's about a rhythm and timing. So just do down strums. I will sail my vessel to the river on the dry Like a bird upon the wind These waters on my sky I'll never reach my destination if I never try, so I will see you happen to the river runs dry. So you, once you do the down strums, you're like, now I got that timing down. And all you're going to do with the finger picking is just within that chord, know which strings you press within the chord. Like I said, the D's the bottom four, C's the bottom, I mean, five, four, three, two, or G's the top, top four, that kind of thing. Know which strings you press and see if you can keep that steady rhythm going with your timing. I will sail my vessel till the river runs dry Like a bird upon the wind These waters on my sky I'll never Remember on the E minor? You went 5, 4, 3, 2, 5, 4, 3, 2 Now the A, same thing 5, 4, 3, 2, 5, 4, 3, 2 In our destination If I never try I will sail my vessel to, uh, yeah, some people like to do this too. You can go five, four. You can go like uh, for a D chord, four, three, two, and flip up the bottom. Some people like to do that. I like to go. I use my thumb the whole time, but you can go four, three, two. Whatever's more comfortable with you. Some people even do the bottom two with the first finger. Whatever works for you. Whatever floats your boat. Hope it helps you guys. I go over a lot of strumming techniques and things that kind of help you advance your playing palm mutes, uh, string stops, different things to do. Over on my ultimate strumming course at countrysongteacher.com. If you don't, if you struggle with strumming, you struggle with finger picking, be sure to scoop that up. It's got a little sale going on now at countrysongteacher.com. Scoop up the ultimate strumming course. I think you'll like that. Hope it's a blessing to you guys. Tune in tomorrow. We'll do another video and keep rocking and rolling. I love you. More importantly, God loves you. Let's go.